All right, welcome back, guys, to another uh, session at Arit BJJ. Uh, yeah, sorry about my voice. I think I caught a cold or something. But yeah, anyways, back to the match. Um, so yeah, right here, I'm just deciding how I should try to take him down. Um, so what I noticed is uh, whenever I go against like bigger guys or like guys with um that a lot that are a lot more skilled than me like i so they they generally take it easy <clears throat> so i feel like just like out of respect or something that i should also take it easy but um in my mind i can't separate like taking it easy and um like not doing my moves tight like tight and crisp like a uh, there should be I should be able to separate the two like just cuz I'm taking it easy shouldn't mean like I'm doing my moves loosely but um yeah that's what ends up happening when I try it so okay right here <clears throat> I looked up a YouTube move and uh I'm trying to do the ninja choke here um and I have tried it after this session several times, and it has never worked. <laughs> uh, I'm probably, I'm sure I'm not doing it correctly. But, uh, man, I end up in this position, like, either side control or mounted, like, just all the damn time. Um, I wish I could just take, like, three to six months where all I do is, uh, like, escapes and counters from um, bottom side control and bottom mount because I mean I feel like 80-90% of the time that's where I'm at like, I learned all these um, moves from like top position mounts and like where I'm already in a advantage and I'm like in rolls I'm pretty much never there so um, yeah. Yeah, I wish I could uh take a significant amount of time where I'm just doing like defensive stuff from those positions. All right, so I try to get my hip out, but he just rotates back. And now I'm in side control with my back flat on the ground. <clears throat> and uh yeah, I'm just trying to avoid the arm triangle. Here, uh, man, when I was in Bali, we spent a lot of time um, defending against uh, or practicing defending against um, what do you call that? Uh, now we got the arm triangle. Um, what was that move? The Darce choke. And, uh, and every time I try to attempt, maybe I'm not remembering it correctly, but yeah, whenever I try to attempt it, it doesn't really work. The best I usually, I'm usually able to do is like the kick out and at least get my head out of there. Out, like, out from like them pressuring my head. Oh, here we go. Did like a back step um, saddle entry. But my right leg is I believe it's below his knee it doesn't really work well if it's below their knee and I'm just trying to work a heel hook here but I'm, he's like able to prevent it somehow and I'm still chasing that foot but it's like <laughs> I don't have control of it anymore alright so yeah back in mount yeah like I said I'm 80 to 90 percent of the time this is where I'm at <clears throat> um, so yeah when I'm mounted I could I'm I I learned more like escapes and defenses against it but um, I'm not sure what he did right there I don't think that was an arm triangle but yeah I only resort to two different escapes which is um the uh, 
elbow escape and the trap and roll. And I do once in a while try to do like variations of the trap and roll. I should have done a gift wrap right here. <clears throat> but um, yeah, look, see how see how uh, my body triangle is really loose. Like I I could get it tighter. I know how to do it. It's just I don't know this like respect thing in my head. I think I'm a Yeah, it's hard for me to separate. There goes ended around. Yeah, it's hard for me to separate like respect and doing the move correctly. I could do it way too loose. Yeah, I'm not sure what we were laughing about right there, but uh, yeah, here we go. Trying to prevent him from going to the side, but he already got um, half guard on me just like that. Pretty much with very little effort. <clears throat> and yeah, I was trying to prevent that um, cross face, but he got it now. Yeah, we're just resetting. Getting too close to the edge of the mat. So I'm trying to get around that leg, but he ends up going around me. Now I'm in this position again, this uh, side control slash back control thingy. Yeah, so at least um, when I'm in bottom side control, like my, my frames aren't too bad, but I don't really use them. To like get my knee in or whatever. So he's setting up the arm bar here, but um, yeah, I'm doing a good job from preventing him from hooking my head with his leg. <coughs> so yeah, that and um, like the back control escape, like I'm not too bad at it. Like uh, I remember, so the back escape thing. We spent a lot of time on that in Bali and um, like the frames inside control uh, we practiced that a lot at my original gym. Okay so he's trying to get like a reverse triangle thing I think. Um, not sure what I'm doing here. I'm not sure what's happening to my arm here. But uh, okay, he's has like this omoplata type thing. Try to roll out. He lets go of the omoplata though. So yeah, back in this position again. I'm like here all the damn time. This little baby cradle thingy. <laughs> like I feel very safe in this position, but I'm not. Like uh, there's so many attacks they could do from. That little I don't I don't even know what the name is, like that cradle position right there. But um trying to I'm really focused on preventing this arm bar that I feel coming. And I oh okay. I did I did a hitchhiker escape. Nice, but I got <laughs> fall right into the um Triangle. Oh, okay, he doesn't have it locked up. I was like uh, mindful about keeping my posture up when he had the or when he was going for the triangle. <clears throat> All right, so I'm sure, what's happening here? Okay, here we go again. Okay, I should have attempted the knee slice right here. I at least angle my right knee in. Now he almost um what do you call that position? The kiss of the dragon position. Okay, <laughs> so I'm here again. I'm like always there, man. It's hard for me to like 
like if I'm working on something in, like during the role it's hard for me to keep more than like one or two moves in my mind that I should go for and all I was thinking about was this the fucking trying to do the ninja choke cuz I I feel so helpless when I'm in um, bottom side control yeah so I'm trying to prevent that triangle from setting in he has the gift wrap on me though but yeah see at least this part I'm mindful of it of um, preventing them from taking my back or at least um, escaping the back control <clears throat> yeah I'm really grateful we spent so much time on that in Bali but, uh, yeah, so I was <laughs> in this position again. And there goes the end of the round. And it's really hard for me to focus on any kind of offense. So, I believe this was the last round of the session. So, yeah, I'm so, um,. Man, generally the arm drag. Okay, I try to do a a butterfly sweep, but it failed. Okay, so I try to do what? What do you call that? Like a backdoor escape or something? But yeah, you got the kimurami. <clears throat> so like those were the two moves I was focusing on: the ninja choke and like the backdoor escape thing. I'm trying to do the arm drag again. It's like when I <clears throat> when I'm not thinking or when I panic, that's like the main thing I go for from that position. It usually doesn't work unless it's uh, someone pretty new. And I wasn't I wasn't putting my all into it. So yeah. Back in this position. Yeah, either mounted or bottom side control. I'm like there all the damn time. So yeah, I saw his leg lifted up. So I was trying to get my knee through, but um, yeah, he ended up getting the triangle. And yeah, right here, man, I wasn't thinking about posturing up, which I should have been. But he lets go of the triangle and I'm able to get my other arm in. So he pretty much has nothing right there. Just in his um, closed guard. Yeah, he's trying to get to my side. And I could feel it. So I'm trying to keep my right elbow nice. That was a sweep. That was a nice sweep. He's trying to keep my right elbow inside. So yeah, see right here all the <laughs> back control escape training. And I'm not sure what I'm doing here, but he's setting up another triangle. <clears throat> ah, man. I suck at this. <laughs> it's like, I'm, I'm like, I'm like settling into my mistakes. I'm like paranoid about that arm he has. Not sure what he did, but some arm attack. <clears throat> oh, okay. Hey, that was a nice counter to the knee slice. But, um, I still have my. Ah, oh, man. Yeah, he smashed me down. Ah. <sighs> Yeah, I'm I'm really bad at um keeping my guard. So he has the anaconda position, I believe. So yeah, right there, that was um I was able to keep my the back of my head from being braced up against his chest. <clears throat> All right, so I was trying to frame on his neck, but. In response, he was able to get control of my arms and feel the armbar coming. And 
yeah in this in that position again but uh yeah at least I got to my knees right here and yeah he's setting up that triangle again and I am really focused on getting my left knee yeah on him I'm not sure why he hooked it for me that that, that just helps my escape but uh, yeah, I got side control and uh, really loose cross face. <laughs> and you see that whole that whole thing was really loose, like a half-assed um, neon belly. And uh, yeah, he got some kind of attack on my leg. I have it in my mind that like I'm being disrespectful if I tighten up. <laughs> But uh, yeah, I really got to get that out of my head. I don't think anybody would be offended if I did my moves tight. I got like a knee bar set up here, but it, it wasn't it wasn't really tight. I was able to get my knee kind of rotated out, and now I'm trying to do the inside heel hook. Is that what it's called? Oh no, I'm just trying to set up a knee bar. <laughs> But I can't get my left leg through the to the other side. So I'm just trying to disengage here. And I don't know what I was trying to do. <clears throat> so yeah, I don't know what I'm trying to do. I don't even have the saddle. He pretty much has a saddle on me. <laughs> But yeah, he did a nice Baron Bolo earlier. I don't know if I mentioned it. But yeah, there goes the end of the round. I will see you guys next time.